Okay, this is our uh, G code uh, generator uh, software, and um, you know, we just got done making a board in our design software, and this is the software that uh, creates code to run our machine. You'll notice that it's very simple again. Um, here's your options for the particular machine that we'll be uh, working with the software. Uh, we, we can pretty much uh, run the software on any three axis and in the near future four axis machine. Uh, this is our code that we use uh, for our particular machine, uh, the header and the end. Um, the velocities or speeds in the different areas of the boards and uh, we can change our passes uh, both rail and, and deck so um, just simply by clicking those arrow, arrow keys. Uh, this is our uh, machine tab and this allows us to use different cutters. These are some of the cutters that uh, we have programmed in that we use. Uh, and you see where all the measurements kind of change down there. And uh, our cutter offset options, post height. Uh, this particular machine is a, a, a post fed uh, machine. We lay the boards on top of these two posts down here. But we also have a uh, option where it will uh, allow you to clamp the uh, nose and tail of the board. I think some of the older machines do it that way. Machine origin. Um, just tells where our offsets are, where we're starting before we hit zero, and uh, we can change our Z direction. Limits are just uh, partic uh, particular to each individual machine. So uh, that's our options in our G code, and let's go ahead and uh, create a G code. So we simply uh, go here and we're going to load a blank file. I'm going to go ahead and use choose that blank. It's a 6.7 Australian blank. It's uh, really good and um, you'll see here where the post actually automatically adjusted to hold the blank this is really key because it just reminds the operator that we need to set our machine at that position it gives it to you both millimeters and in inches and after that's set uh, we go ahead and load our design I'm going to go ahead and load a design that I designed for this and uh, at that point the, the, the board that we designed is in yellow the blank is in green uh, we use these different arrows that adjust the millimeters to get our board into position uh, to where we're ready to make a mill. And uh, we just go ahead and angle that down. Some of the other programs, they, they have this, they, they like to use the mouse to position things, and I hate it because it just it moves everything everywhere and it becomes a real uh, disaster when, when you're trying to do things. So that looks pretty good to me. Uh, you could always hit the zoom button if you wish. Uh, you can see where we're missing down here. I'll just go ahead and tap that up a bit. And that looks like we're going to hit uh, all the different aspects of our design. Um, in the near future, we're going to have a measurement wizard in here that will allow you to uh, tell the operator where exactly the uh, tail and nose of the board are relative to the blank. And at that point, we simply hit uh, Create G-Code, and that will store your G-Code in uh, uh, whatever directory you wish, and you call it up into our uh, uh, CAM software next, and basically uh, mill away. Thanks.